We have a large caliber and we are shooting at priority targets. We shoot at warehouses, at cannons. There were shots from there. The radar detected them. Do you have five self-propelled howitzers? Six. Valkyrie, Bunny, Thor, Fury, Bitch, and Antares. We received them in October and have been preparing them since October. We have four Ukrainian vehicles and two Russian trophy vehicles. We prepared them, literally slept around them for two and a half months. This one was taken near Kharkiv, and the other one was taken near Chernihiv. It took a long time to prepare, check, test, and maintain them. Other units also have them, but they are not registered. They do not belong to the armed forces. Maybe they've recovered it somewhere, and now they work. Is this a post-Soviet generation of self-propelled howitzers? We have one vehicle made in 1991. It is the last of the Soviet Union's production. And these? These are from 1990. But in Russia, they are now producing new modifications. They look the same, but they have more electronics. They work like AHS crab, but with coordinates. No aiming circle, right? Yeah. They are firing a missile guided by a drone. The drone lights up the target with a laser, they shoot at the target. They still have another shell. We are shooting with conventional high-explosive, rocket-propelled munitions. Valkyrie, do you copy? We have reached the target for today. Everyone is tired of it. Now the drones will confirm the target. The headquarters will give the command, then we will shoot. I'm Valkyrie. If it stands still, it consumes 70 to 80 liters per hour. On a good frozen mode, it consumes 450 to 500 liters. Therefore, a gasoline tanker must travel with every six vehicles. They have a 1,350 liter tank. This is the electronics of the tower. You can rotate it, raise it, so you don't have to do it manually because these guns have no barrel stabilization. And if it works with the engine on, there will be vibration. If the vehicle is running on an autonomous power supply system, it is set to 40,000 RPM. This is a real helicopter engine. And when there is a vibration, tanks have gun stabilization, they can even shoot on the move. This cannon fires only from a standstill, because it has a higher return. The tank has a smooth barrel, there, the shell is flying out of the cannon without recoil, and here is a rifled barrel. Now we use the aiming circle to orient the gun on the ground, and we are waiting for the target command. That is, the X and Y coordinates of the target. And then we'll be aiming, turning the barrel to the coordinates. And when the gun is fully oriented on the target, we wait for the command, or there will be a command to open fire when ready or on command. If on command, then we will wait for the command. If you're ready, we'll get set up and recharge. Then we'll take the shot. Did you sign the shell? Revenge for the director. Now we will send greetings to the Russians. We have a wounded guy lying in Kiev. 
wounded by rocket fragments. So promise first shell, revenge for the director. I suspect that in three or four days the front will come here. It's on its way. They are shooting with cluster shells, and then with grads, or with grads, and then with cluster shells. Well, what's the result? We allegedly hit an ammunition depot, and the house where the enemies were sitting. This is what was seen. The warehouse was smashed to pieces. We hit it right in the middle of it. We have a video. I saw smoke coming out of the building, I said. There was definitely ammunition there, because the building itself does not smoke, and this one was smoking. Two of the shells hit exactly. The third one hit a little bit behind. The shooting is breathtaking. <laughs> Everything is emotionally as dry as possible. Emotions will come later. The enemy army will be thrown beyond the borders of Ukraine. Until then, we have a lot of work. How was your work today? With good results. Glory to God, the team and the command, we have worked effectively. Congratulations on your baptism of fire. There you go. Yeah, yeah. That's not enough. That's it. Now you're a real gunner. Loaded, ready, and firing. It deformed her well. Well done. We shoot first from the rope, the rest from the cover. You were probably here to cheer? Yes, very much so. We send one into the trench. Look! Shot fired. <laughs> Вы вот души.